Hey everybody! The sun is shining, summer is here, and it is the perfect time of year for fabric dyeing. And today on Make Your Mark, we are trying three different techniques using Talon's Art Creation Tie Dye. This stuff is awesome. The first thing we're going to do is a sun print using foliage from my backyard. And next, we're going to try a salt and stencil technique. And finally, we're going to do some funky folding with a simple tie-dye technique to see if we can get some great stripes. Now you can use these fabric pieces for bunting, table napkins, fabric art journals, quilting, you name it. Now don't forget to thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment if you have a question about this project or you just want to say hello. And you know how much I love it when you say hello. Are you ready? Let's dye fabrics. Cardboard wrapped in plastic wrap is the perfect surface for your pieces because you can easily move them around to catch the sun while they dry. I think these pieces would make beautiful placemats or table napkins, but you could even frame one for a wonderful piece of art. Tie dye is a modern term made popular in the 1960s in the United States. It's used as a reference for a set of ancient resist dyeing techniques and it typically consists of manipulating fabric and then binding with string or rubber bands followed by the application of dye. The earliest examples of tie-dye are from 5th century China. I wonder if they were rocking bell-bottoms back then. Pennant is a narrow tapering flag commonly flown by ships at sea. But let's face it, they look great at birthday parties and on fireplace mantles. I'm gonna leave a link below in the description to everything I used for this project. Thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press that notification bell so you know I have a new video. Grab any one of my craft books for inspiration. I'm going to leave a link below to those as well and I will see you next week. Bye.